and welcome back to another Country Collector's video. It's been a while since I met the last one, I'm sorry, I've been a little bit lazy. Um, <laughs> and uh, I also don't know really what to up upload. And I will stream sometime soon, I know I postponed it and then I never did it. And it was this whole big thing. But I will sometime, okay? A few announcements as always. Country Collectors Discord server will be in the description if you want to join that. It's awesome. We talk there a lot. Also, thank you guys all so much for the support. We just, we're about to hit 315 subscribers, which is a lot. So thank you so much for all the support in these videos. I'm so glad that the Country Collectors community is able to come together and, you know, just watch my videos. Yeah, I want to make some more videos in the future, but... No, no guarantees. Um, but I'll try to make uh, some more videos, you know, going in the future. Last announcement: If you see me, um, this is my avatar right now. Um, I will probably have this avatar on. I might change it a little bit for Christmas, but a little bit broke. <laughs> but yeah, if you see me, come come say hi. Um, we can trade. We can do whatever. Um, I'm not uh, someone that hates uh, fans. I will say hi to you, and it will be amazing, and I love meeting new fans and new people in this game. Anyways, let's get into the video, we have a lot to cover. <laughs> now, the first thing to cover is all of the new pins, which I am not going to cover, because I barely have any of them, honestly. But there is a lot of new pins. I know there's these oblasts, which are like Russian provinces. There's also a lot of new historicals and SSR pins, so let me try to find some. Well, right here, that's that's the new historical Amazonia. There's some of those, but there's also a lot of USSR pins. Uh, yeah, don't don't mind my uh, Turkmenistan obsession. All right, I found a USSR pin that is new, and I have it. Uh, this is the Far Eastern Republic. Just one example of it. We also have finally the some Canadian provinces such as British Columbia, which is very welcome. We also have a bunch of new shop exclusives, such as Azores, I hope I'm saying that right, and Alderney, just some examples. And right over here, we also have Brazilian provinces, which got added a long time ago, and most of you watching this probably already know, um, that this got added, but yeah, I didn't cover it because it came out like the same day I made that video, so my bad. If you didn't know, yeah, these are, there's Brazilian provinces now. There's also a lot new of new impossibles, but I don't have like any of them because the economy is kind of in a bad state right now. It's really hard to get coins. But yeah, that's just that for now. All right, let's move on to the next thing. So one of the new biggest things that is actually really cool is this little World Cup Center. So uh, as a lot of you guys know, um, a lot or a lot is happening. There's F there's the FIFA World Cup uh, 2022 hosting it uh, hosted in Qatar. I recommend watching it. It's pretty it's pretty cool. If you like uh, football, soccer, whatever you want to call it, it's pretty cool. Oh, uh, that. Okay, so, my bad. Uh, if you actually equip them, so let's do England, Germany, and Ghana. Also, sorry for that weird pause. That was my bad. Um, so you, uh, you can see, uh, it shows the little name, and then it has this cool little. I keep saying little in this video. I swear, it has this cool background that just says. Qatar World Cup 2022, and it goes all the way around it, and then it has the country's flag, and these are really cool pins. So yeah, there's, of course, there's 32 uh, countries playing on the World Cup, so you can claim one for all of them. If you want to see which ones there are, 
without actually having to look up the World Cup. Uh, all of the flags are here, so you can kind of preview which teams there are. So yeah, claim these uh, claim these uh, when you can, because this is good. Now, next thing I want to show you guys is this really cool new way to get coins. So if you actually come over to the mountains area, uh, you can find this little bridge that goes over this lake. Uh, it was added here recently. Um, don't try to jump into the lake. Um, personal experience. But yeah, all I have to do to start this uh, national anthem quiz, which is what this is. I don't even think I mentioned that. I'm stupid. But yeah, there's this national anthem quiz. So step into it, and it'll ask you to choose your difficulty. Personally, I don't feel like uh, trying to stream just yet, but I'll show you that. So let's try easy. You select it, and I'll play a little anthem. And of course I know this anthem, because it is of my own country. So, if you get it right, you get um, an easy one right, you get 47 to, I think, 49 coins. Uh, I don't know this anthem. There's no way. Okay, so if you fail it, um, then it'll just drop you into the bridge, and you'll fall into the lake. And whenever you fall into the lake, you just spawn back here. So then you can... Start over again, but it keeps going until you get one wrong. So let's try moderates. So I don't know this one either. Uh, it was Guam. I'm just gonna keep trying this until I get a moderate one right because I actually I'm actually bad at this. So I just want to show you how many coins you get. So you actually get 72 coins uh, for getting this. Uh, I'm gonna guess Greece. Oh, it was Luxembourg. <laughs> and I already know Extreme gives you 97 to 99 coins. So, yeah, there you go. Uh, pretty cool. You can get a lot of coins from that if you actually grind it out. Um, but yeah, that's that. Quick little change here. If you actually win the um, win this country mini game, as you can see, you get 20 coins. It used to be 15. If you didn't realize that. Yeah, you get five more coins. Also, I've been getting a lot of comments on my original guide about chests. So let me just kind of explain that briefly. So there should be two. We know of two locations. Um, in the mountains, which is up there and behind the mountain. Um, one up there on the top of that little shack and inside of it. And there's three in this one, actually. So let me show you. So, right here used to be the rare, uh, rarest pins thing. It's kind of inaccurate, but uh, there's actually a chest spawn right behind it, or where it was. It's not here anymore. But yeah, uh, there are, a chest can spawn right here. A chest, as many of you know, can also spawn around here. And of course, one on top of this rock right here. So yeah, that's all the updates I have to go over, basically. <laughs> Let me know if there's anything big um, that I missed or anything I missed at all that you want me to cover. Or uh, if you have any questions, uh, I still answer questions, believe it or not. Um, if you just comment any on um, any video, I'll probably answer it. Thanks for watching, and yeah, I'll see you guys on the next one. Uh, goodbye. <laughs>